This video is brought to you by the brand new Roxio GameCap Pro HD, the same device I use in my videos. It's light, compatible with both HDMI and component cables, and its included software records, edits, and even live streams game footage straight to Twitch.tv. If you're interested in making HD gameplay videos like me, click the link in the description to learn more. Hello and welcome everybody. It's back to my Mario 64 playthrough. Um, I'm really enjoying it. This is a game I played a lot as a kid, so I'm hoping to just plow right through it. Um, show you guys some of the fun things about it. Maybe even share a few of the Easter eggs that I'm aware of. Um, and yeah. So I, I cleared out the first five stars in the bomb on battlefield. Um, not much to do until I get the flying cap later. And I'm saving the hundred coin stuff for later. So, um, Womp's Fortress. Let's go. Like most levels, um... Well, not most levels, but at least the first few. They'll start you off with kind of like a boss. So, we're headed on our way up. Ah, these guys. Okay, so typically, the game will tell you to crawl up. I'm going to do it now just for fun, but... These guys used to terrify me as a kid. They took more damage than a regular foe, and they were just kind of scary. But yeah, all you do is crawl up and breakdance, kick them in the face. Woohoo! And you get five coins from it, so not bad. But, um, if you run fast enough, you can just punch him in the face. I'm not gonna test it with- well, what the heck. I'm a rebel. Okay, so this guy's right here. I'm just gonna dive right at the wall. <laughs> Alright, I just made a fool of myself- oh my god. Ugh. I'm, I'm like, never gonna show you guys fun things in this game again, because that was just the worst. All right, this guy I can do it on. Mm. There, let's see. <laughs> but yeah, that's why they recommend crawling, I'm sure. All right, run through here. I used to be able to like long jump to the middle and long jump over, but after the, after that last fiasco, I don't really know. Here's a fun little tip. You can jump on these guys' backs to grab three coins from them before you take the five from straight up killing them. So, I don't know, if you're trying to go for 100 coins, it's a nice way to get a few extras. But yeah, um, what I did with him, jump through his legs, is what I'm just about to do with King Thwomp. So, let's do it. It makes me so mad. We build your houses, your castles, we pave your roads, and you still walk all over us. Do you want to say thank you? No. Well, you're not going to wipe your feet on me. I think I'll crush you just for fun. Do you have a problem with that? Just try and pound me, wimp. Ha! This guy, I actually feel bad. <laughs> he actually has a reason to be angry. Like, he's... They take, like, the actual physical approach that he is a slab of marble or whatever, and... He's sick of getting stepped on all the time. Unfortunately, um, he, he has to just get pounded on instead, so... Things are just not getting much better for him. You're crushed again! I'm just a stepping stone after all. I won't gravel or grovel. Oh god, that's a horrible pun. <laughs> you win. Take this with you. Thank you, Thwomp. Er, Womp? Or er, shoot. I'm getting confused now, because there's... The guys that smash you from above, they're in this stage too, the blue guys. And then these guys- okay, Womp, I think is what those are called. And Thwomps are the blue ones? Who knows, the enemies in this world are ridiculous. So, uh, next star, remember, pretty similar. You just have to get to the top. So, there's like a little tower in place for where he used to be. But yeah, um... Should be simple enough, and I'm gonna do this again so I don't feel like a fool for talking about it. <laughs> Head over. Ooh. Okay. I'm gonna pass you up. Thought I wasn't gonna make the jump at first. You. And up we go. There's like a bullet bill that fires that can hit you while you're down, but if you keep climbing up, it won't bother you. I think. I could be wrong, but I think that might be the only bullet bill in this, uh, entire level. 
I gotta think about that. I don't know. Um, we'll see if he if he shows up somewhere else, but he's not too prevalent in this game. And there we go. Second star in this uh, Womp's Fortress. And if I can remember correctly, I think the rest of the stars in this are really easy. There's some obscure ones. You're shooting at the wild blue. Um, there's two stars that require cannon in this level, despite it being small and not very suited to the cannon. God, I for some reason cannot get up here. There we go. Um, here's the first one. A little bit more straightforward. Talk to Pinky over here. And down we go. So this one, I've always found it easiest. Um, what you need to do is get into this area. I am around here, try and hit that wall to get some recoil. So, just like that. Right off the wall, down the pole, and ta-da! Another star. And, um, I don't know if it's the next one or not, but I'll do the next one that requires the cannon, just because it is a ridiculous star. Yep, so we can continue. I could technically fight Bowser now, but I'll stock up since I'm probably going to go for the 120. Okay, so yeah, the, the next one requires the owl from what it wants me to do, but I'm going to do the next cannon one anyways. But it is... I don't know if there's a sign or something, or if this is another one of those things you need to have a guide or talk to a friend about, because this is a weird thing. The game relies on the fact that you see these one pixel thin walls and think that they look a little weird and you have to fire at the corner totally bizarre um i i used a guide to figure this one out when i was a kid uh, i don't know how you would know otherwise to do that <laughs> i think you almost always take damage out of that too but yeah um super weird but it's another star so i guess you can't complain Ugh. gotta stop pressing the button before i go though And... okay, it's, it's right there. Come to me. Just kind of stops mid-slide. As soon as he gets to the star, he can stand completely still. Blast away the wall. Like, what What would that mean to you? I don't, I don't know. That's one of the weirder ones. Very strange game design. Oh, it's, it's gonna ask for red coins. I'm gonna do the last non-red coin star also. Since I know how to do that one. It's Mr. Owl! Who, who's there? Who woke me up? It's still daylight, I should be sleeping! Hey, as long as I'm awake, why not take a short flight with me? Press and hold A to grab and uh, blah blah blah, I'm going to get you this one star. I'm a very strange mechanic. Just made a Mr. Owl joke in, uh... What do you call it? Alright, see, it's right here. I'm gonna take a lamp, because he'll he gets a little bit lower as you go. I made a Mr. Owl joke on my Poke Play video. Shoot, the camera's getting a little weird, though. Uh, I probably should have gone there. Come on! Uh, no! <laughs> Shoot. I dropped at an angle, um, which is weird. Normally, he just drops you straight down. Uh, I think I... Oh, God. I have to wait for him to come back down. Mr. Owl? There you are. Ugh. Normally, always get that. Wee! I almost feel like dropping. Like, I mean, you're supposed to drop him as soon as you see his shadow. I must have just act like over it. I normally go. to I'm gonna do like one longer loop, so I can come in and have some time to think about it. There we go. <sighs> I thought I was gonna overshoot it again. There we go. Um. And last but not least, red coins. And if I do it fast enough, I think I might even have time to mess around on the slide. So, we'll see. Um, I just have to remember where the red coins are. Um, I guess there aren't any at all down here. <laughs> These blocks, they're adorable. They have, like, little girl eyes. It's, it's kind of silly. Whew, that was a weird slide. Could have been bad. <laughs> Could have been bad also. Um, I think the next one's on top of this guy's head. 
Yeah. Oh, God. Which is weird. His The surface on his head... Oh, oh I was going to say it doesn't look walkable. It apparently isn't very walkable either. Um, but I know, I know you can get up on there. No, for some reason, I feel like you were able to ride his head to get onto those platforms. I have no idea how you could do that. So I'm going to use the owl later. Ah, uh, shoot. Missed that one. We're going we're gonna to have to do this the long way. I'm not going to try and quick kill you. We saw what happened last time. <clears throat> Something like that. I like, this is like one random maneuver he can do. Like, just the fact that they even included this. There's so much depth to the amount of platforming. Like, push and slide. That's something that I feel like should not have been implemented this early of a game. You can do a lot of stuff with Mario. Oh my god. Like, fall right off the top of edges. He programmed it that way. That That is a great addition. Great game design. No, oh, that's entirely my fault. Remember I... Did I take a hit there? I don't even know what happened. These guys respawn almost instantly. Okay. Alright, maybe I'm gonna save the slides for next episode, because we've got the winter stage 2 I'm gonna do next, and there's slides in that also, so... Uh, we'll make it a big slide-a-thon. Gotta get to the end of here. Five. Okay, I think... I think... The last, yeah, the last two are on those floating islands, so I don't have to climb the tower anymore. I know that there's a there's a way to. All right, here's here's a way to climb slopes when you're frustrated like me. Shoot, I don't know how to go facing the other direction, like this. Okay, jump and kick and backwards. I've done this. Oh my god, <laughs> now I can't do it. When I there we go. I've done this way more than I should ever have to, but <laughs> sometimes it's a necessary evil. There we go. And take me up, Mr. Owl. Yep, I know your story. Let's fly. And, um, yep, there's two. Like, those just kind of appeared in front of me. Why am I... I'm glad I hit that, but for some reason I'm dropping off at, at an angle with him. I normally go straight down. I can't complain. <laughs> uh, that should not have been so stressful. Um, but I've got, I've got it all. And we can head back. Perfect. And there we go. Um, I think that's all the stars in Blomp's Fortress, other than the coin one. Um, yeah. I'm going to jump in just in case. I can't remember if I've gotten... S oh, yeah, of course I've gotten six. I have 11 total. So, yeah, um, there's uh, Wom's Fortress. I'll grab the coins later. Thanks a ton for watching, and tune in for some slide action next episode. Peace.